Good evening, Miss Victoria. How was your day? Ooh, my good. How did you get to my house? Ooh, did you forget? Your friend Natalie gave me your addresses. You hear? You didn't waste much time. Hello, Whitkin. There's a small fortune in there. Help yourself. You are a vulture, Corso. Who isn't in our business? You'd stoop to anything. Fair Quixote, by Ibarra? You bet I would. Unscrupulous, thoroughly unscrupulous. Good hunting. Whitkin just called me. He's spitting blood. What's his problem? He says you're a double dealing, money grubbing bastard. He says he had that sale tied up, and now you've queered his pitch. He should be quicker off the mark. May I? Your valuation was way over the odds it's brought those people out in a rash. They're now asking twice what the books are worth. He's talking about suing you. Well, let's face it, you screwed him. That's what it's called. I know what it's called. He also says you snaffled the Don Quixote. The Ibarra Don Quixote, 1780, four volumes. Fantastic. Snow the bitch, you're the best in the business. Definitely. And the most expensive. That client of yours, Miss Wiss, is he still interested in this edition? Sure, but Whitkin will blow a fuse. I told him I had nothing to do with this operation. Nothing except your 10%. 20. The Swiss is my client, remember. No deal. 15. For my children's sake. You don't have any. I'm still young. Give me time. 10. Frank. Hell, what happened in here? Now that's really odd. What? What is it? Frank? Why ain't you telling anything? Are you angry with me till now? I am sorry. Frank, I did not mean to make you upset like this. Please, forgive me. You can't love a girl like me.